Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your love reading. This is for the month of October 2020. I'm going to go ahead and pick a card that represents your energy and another card that represents the energy of whoever you're dealing with in love. And that might be someone you're dating, someone you're in a relationship with, or someone you're getting to know, someone you're interested in. Let's see what's going on with them and their mind and in their emotions and let's see what's going on with you okay so I'm going to cut the deck and I'm starting with your energy first card we have here Sagittarius is the chariot card this is your energy this is the energy of cancer um, so I feel like with this card Cancer, cancer is a sign that is a, an emotional sign. I feel like you're feeling deeply emotional in this month of October. You're feeling impulsive, I want to say. You're feeling like um, in a state of extremes with this black cat and this white cat. I f these are opposite colors, so I feel like you're in this very... Um, in this day of one day you're feeling extremely happy and the other day you're feeling depressed you know you're you have very strong emotional fluctuations that, that go up and down in extreme ways um, and I feel it's because you wanna you want to get something moving in your life like you wanna head to a certain direction and I feel like a little bit with this card that something's blocking you, something's preventing you from charging forward towards whatever direction it is that you want to go in. Um, and this is a love reading, so I feel like this is you wanting to pursue someone, someone to chase someone, to go after someone, but feeling um, strong emotional doubts feeling um, uncertainty um, even though at the same time you feel like you just want to jump and you just want to run to someone um, something is holding you back so let's get a card for the other person whoever you're dealing with okay the other person is the nine of pentacles so this is the card of being single so um, you're dealing with someone who's single who's who has this very independent energy they have everything they need in life they have all the pentacles they need all the money they need um, they're a very established very stable person um, they're a very attractive person confident I want to say and um, I feel like they're kind of just um, enjoying themselves and um, enjoying being single um, for some of you though this person might be just be waiting for you um, this doesn't mean that because they're single they don't want to be in a relationship they might be waiting for you to to make the first move Sagittarius or to show to ex you know to show a sign of interest and to um, they're waiting for you to express for you to express their emotions towards them but I feel like I said you're being you're holding yourself back even though you really want to um, move towards this person even you desire this person um, you feel a strong emotional bond to this person but they're just in this state of kind of waiting they're not in a rush they're taking their time um, like I said, they're not dependent on you or anyone. They're independent. They have everything they need in life. Um, they know they're beautiful. They know they're attractive. They know they can get anyone who they want to get. So, yeah, they're just like, you know, um, enjoying the scenery. Not in any urgency to make a move or to take action towards you so let me pick another card to clarify your energy Sagittarius 
Right, okay, so clarifying your energy is the Page of Cups um, next to the Chariot. So, again, this, this card is an offer of love. It's you expressing your love. It's you demonstrating your love to someone. Um, and I feel like in October, you're just going to feel very motivated, very um, very energized to to tell someone how you feel and to to show them that that you care for them and that you want something with them you want to date them you want to get to know them you want to um, love them so yeah again I feel like this is what you want to do but again I feel a little bit of hesitancy with these black and white cat I feel like this represents insecurity. Let's see what the other person is feeling. It's clarifying the Nine of Pentacles. Okay, we have clarifying the Nine of Pentacles, the Three of Pentacles. So this is a card of teamwork, of cooperation, of, you know, coming together um, with another person and working together on a similar goal or on the same goal or on on the same um on the same idea so with the three of pentacles i feel like the other person is willing to to put in the effort to to make this relationship work between you two i feel like they're willing to cooperate they're willing to put in the effort they're willing to become a team with you um, but again, they're like waiting for you here. You can see how they're standing here, um, like just waiting to be um, pursued, to be approached. Um, so yeah, they are willing to work with you and to um, to form a relationship with you because this 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 is the three of Pentacles. Which is you, um, them, the other person, and the third pentacles represents the relationship. So they are interested, Sagittarius. They're very interested, and they're very willing, and they're very single. So yeah, I hope this was helpful, Sagittarius. Um, give me a, a thumbs up if you resonated with this reading, and I'll see you next time in my next video. Bye, Sagittarius.